Good morning, PASW family and friends. Happy Wednesday, another summer in New York. I'm doing a whole series this summer. Where we're going to check out as many shows as we can here in the fabulous Broadway, New York City. Today, we're in front of the Richard Rogers Theater. And I'll tell you why we're here when we, after we move in groove. Well, let's get to some moving and grooving today. Take a nice deep breath and blow it out. And another nice deep breath and blow it out. Good. All right, guys. So, like I said, every other Wednesday for the summer for Motivation and Wednesday, I'm going to be in New York City. Um, right now, we're in one of the Richard Rogers Theater with where Hamilton has been playing for years. I think it opened in 2016. So we're still here. here. But we're actually not going to talk about Hamilton today. We are going back. There's something here they do every Friday called Ham for Ham. What Ham for Ham is, is People in New York, sometimes when they want to see a show, they had to wait in line for hours. Or they wait in line to get a ticket. And, you know, the tickets are expensive. So the man from Miranda, who was the genius beside um, Hamilton, a few years ago started something called Ham for Ham, where cats from Broadway shows come and perform for people waiting in line for tickets. And I, I believe it shut down during COVID. It shut, probably shut down in the winter, but they're back again this summer. So what we're going to do every few weeks is see some hamper ham performances. The performances we are going to see today are from the cast of Camelot and Kimberly a kendo which literally just won at Tony at the Tony Awards. So we're going to see a couple of songs from there. Just because it's just to share performances. I always get inspired when I see good performances. And that's why I want to share it with you. Just to get inspired for our motivational Wednesday. So let's go to our hand for hand and I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> with the Writers Guild. Ah! We believe writers deserve a living wage and that robots should write the things we love and that we watch on TV and film. So thank you for supporting the WGA um, in everything they do and in this fight. Full stop. Second of all, 
it occurred to me that as much as we love the Tonys, they should not be the be-all and end-all of your exposure to this incredible theater season. Yeah. We have so much to celebrate, and we have such an amazing season of theater now that we are, you know, mostly through the pandemic and people are coming to support live theater again. Um, so, this is our first ham for him, but we will have, we will be showing selections from all of the best musical and best musical live nominees over the next few weeks. If you couldn't make it today live, you can come back next Friday at 4 o'clock. And we will have more for you. Um, I did not want to do this alone. You gotta move. Because um, I have two incredible co-hosts today from the amazing production of Doll's House on Block That Way. Just fantastic.
Dad, I really hope you enjoyed that. I love watching talent, good talent, great artists doing what they love to do. That's why I wanted to spend the summer in New York. We may come back for another hand to hand and also see some other shows or performances from other shows while we're here. Um, New York is Broadway. There's so much theater, so much wonderful art that goes on here. So that's why I thought it would be fun to spend part of our summer in my summer classes in New York. So let's end it the way we begin it with a little bit more moving and grooving. And I'll see you tomorrow in person. And I'll be um, with the all new YouTube class Friday. Love you guys. Miss you guys. Have a great day. This is the music to you away, guys. That's why I love to do the moving and grooving.